Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Joey Biagas and I'm an audio engineer and a musician of a few years now. And today I'm gonna to show you how to make a loop fade out inside of GarageBand. So let's get to it. All right, so I have GarageBand open here and I have a drum kit that is a loop, as you can see here. So if I hover over the right top right corner of the region, I have the loop icon. I can click and drag and extend the loop just to kind of prove that it's a loop. But there you guys go, that is a loop. Let's go ahead and fade out this loop and figure out how to do that because it's a little different inside of GarageBand, okay? So what you wanna do is you wanna select the track, make sure you're on the loop track, not on a different track. So make sure it's highlighted like so. Okay, and then we wanna go to track up here and then you wanna go down to fade out, okay? And then that's going to create a fade out pretty much on the master volume right here. So if we want it to fade out at a certain point, we can kind of play around with it and we can click and drag these points to where we want it to fade out. Okay, so let's kind of fix this up just a little bit, make this a little bit more drastic. Okay, let's take a listen. Okay. So that's pretty much it guys, it's not much to it. All you have to do is select the track and go ahead and go to track and go to fade out. Now if you do have any other questions, please let us know, but thank you for watching.